I think I might be going live. Ooh, well, it's clear. I did not brush my hair or put, welcome to live chat. Remember to guard your privacy and be able to abide by our community guidelines. Hi guys. Um, hopefully you can hear me. Um, if you can't, please let me know in the chat, which I'm trying to figure out where it is. Cause as I said, YouTube went and moved my cheese. Okay. I think, I think, I think we are good. So um, I'm gonna be try to be watching over here. I don't see the, hold on. Am I live? Am I live? I am. Oh, Mom, woo. We're to guard your privacy and be able to abide by our Oh, okay, guys. I don't need to listen to myself. Um, hopefully you can <laughs> hear me. Um, okay. If you can't, please let ah, me know. I guess I can hear myself. Which is good. Hi. Um, I have no idea where the chat is. Oh, somebody said something. <laughs> this is going to be us all night. Um, hello. Hi, Dark Rose. Hi, Frosting. Hey, Miss Roxy. Hey, Friday Ketchup. Hi, 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 hi. Hey, Beetle. It's just going to be me. Like, you guys are going to get a no makeup up the nose shot this whole time. <laughs> yeah, I have no idea where you would think on the iPad it would show me, you know, what you guys are saying. Because I'm sure you guys can see each other, right? At least I hope you can. Cassie, hi. Cindy, hi. Emily, hi. Hi, hi, hi. 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 So I um, originally was like, oh, I'm going to so apologize for like not having any makeup on. But you know what? That's okay, right? We just got to do what you got to do. And I've noticed my hair is getting bigger as the day has gone by. <laughs> so, all right. So I thought this would be kind of fun to do a live stream while I am packing for my very first ever Dapper Day. Um, if you guys uh, don't know, Dapper Day is a day at Disney World in Disneyland. Hey, Diana. Hey, Cassie. We're all human. Oh, thanks, Doc Rose. Um, so everybody dresses up. Oh, thank you, Frosting. Psh, be real. No stress zone. Exactly. Oh, thank you. It is brand spanking new. I'm still getting used to it. I think I like it better than the blue. I don't know. So, um... I figured everybody dresses up for Dapper Day, really fancy. Um, they don't really encourage Disney bounding on Dapper Days. So JL is going with me. You guys know her from the Viva Lot vlogs and others. Um, and we are doing two days at the park. We're doing Saturday at Disneyland. And then we're doing Sunday at Disneyland as well. But Sunday is Dapper Day. So I am dressing for both Dapper Day and Disney bounding on the day that is not Dapper Day. I use a lot of words to say things that could be said like that. <laughs> so, um, believe it or not, this is the suitcase I am going to be using. I know, crazy, right? It is carry-on size, um, but see, I feel, see, oh, yay, Jal, yeah. I, you know, I really, really wish that I, chat viewing options, live chat, all messages are visible. I wish it would come up like along the side. What's this button do? Oh, great. I can make myself have a dance dance party, but I can't really see chats all that well. So I don't know. We'll figure it out, you guys. We'll make it work. And now I don't know how to make that go away because I'm like a 50 year old with the remote control. So yeah, um, that is the suitcase I'm using. It is a checked bag, so I could go bigger if I need to. Um, crinoline in the pantyhose. Oh, that's a good idea. But I have another trick. Let's actually get to that right now. So, I recently bought, hey, Jessica. Oh, <laughs> did you see my little pumpkin pa pillow? It's so cute. All right. So, I think the number one question people have when you dress vintage and you travel is what the heck do you do with your crinolines because they're so big and this is literally like the size of my suitcase and this is a brand new Melco Modes Megan crinoline it's my favorite crinoline 
Um, and it is a smaller crinoline than a lot of them with only having two layers in it, but being brand new, it's really super puffy. So, um, Friday Ketchup does the, um, you wear it, Cassie. Um, Friday Ketchup does it in the pantyhose. And um, I do wear my crinolines quite often on the plane. Um, vacuum bag is a great way to do it as well. Um, what I do is I, here, we'll, we'll put it on the bed here. I roll it up as small and as tight as humanly possible because this one's so big, you guys, I am not wearing this on the plane. Um, it'd just be more trouble than it's worth. So I get it. It's like, oh, yay, candy bites. Yes, 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 yes. I hope I see you as well. Make sure you stop me if you see me. Are you going to be at Dapper Day? <laughs> so what I do is I do it as long as possible because I find it fits better. And I take my hair ties. And I do like two or three of them around the crinoline so that it stays in the shape that I want it to be in. And then it just tucks in like along the edge or at the bottom. And I use this a lot of times to, are you packing the kitty? He's already been in the suitcase like twice. He hates it when I go away. And when I apparently give him affection. So um, that's kind of how I've been doing my crinolines lately. I really like it because it's a way of bringing hair ties and not having to worry about it. And like I said, it fits really well at the bottom of the suitcase and it does squish down. Because I find that when you're packing, you always seem to have room around the sides of your suitcase. So if you can roll stuff up onto the sides, it's perfect. So let's get to the outfits. I actually am traveling Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday, and Thursday, Monday are travel days. So don't tell anybody, but I tend to wear the same outfit on both days because it just saves for packing because you're just getting on a plane. So, right. So Thursday is going to be Mondays and that leaves us with Friday. So what are we going to be doing on Friday? We are going to be in a murder bank. Thank you. It was, I made, I got bought, bought this at Kohl's. I think it's, um, hey Holly. It is, um, Vera Wang. This is, I've been living in caftans lately. So Friday, we're going to be doing a lot of shopping. Um, we're going to be running around Burbank, having a bunch of fun rumor has it there's a gaming cat cafe there so um wow at Kohl's I know right the only thing I don't like about it I don't know if you guys can see this but is the fact that it doesn't go all the way down so it's not as long as my vintage caftans well thank you Lauren thanks I'm very excited about it it's a little bit darker than I intended but I'm going to be wearing one of my Atomic Starlet skirts with the back pockets. Thank you, Button. And the bat's on the bottom. Even though Friday will be after Halloween, I don't care. October lasts through Thanksgiving. Burlington Coat Factory. Dark Rose. Good find. So um, this is the skirt I am going to be wearing. I don't necessarily iron things before, thank you. The bats are brilliant. I don't necessarily iron them before putting them in the suitcase because guess what, they're gonna get wrinkled. The um, hotels are going to have irons, so I'm a time saver. I don't wanna iron twice, so this goes. Yay, <laughs> 3 a.m. Wendy, that's I love you. I love you, Wendy. It's good to see you, though. Every day can be Halloween. We are actually trying to figure out. YouTube changed the way that they do live streams. They don't do it with Google Hangouts anymore. Um, they sold out. They were a couple years ago, and they've already sold out. You are a champion, Wendy. Um, but sadly, I lost my train of thought. I 
camera anymore. Oh, well, there you go. So, um, I basically just kind of fold up my skirts and lay them. I really hate putting suitcases on the bed, but we're going to do it for you guys. We're going to do it. So essentially I take the suitcase and I pack the cat. You okay? And <laughs> basically I just kind of fold and lay it. And then that way I just kind of layer things in there. Um, or take the cat. I would take the cat if I could. Um, I know a lot of people will like roll their items. That's a way of doing it as well. Which for this kind of suitcase works really good as well. For the top. You know, okay, this is where I'm struggling. What? Wait, what? What did Wendy say? If it fits, it sits. <laughs> um, it, it, it is a simplicity. Uh, Joanne Fabrics has a lot of the simplicity vintage stuff. And I'm buying it constantly. So, <laughs> I know, I love it. So, here's the thing. This is the top I want to wear. It's a collective top. It's a really stretchy one. The only thing is the sleeves are a little bit tight, so it's a little bit uncomfortable. Um, but I think it would look really cute with the bat. Thank you, Diana. Um, I love it with the bats. Um, I'm going to bring it as an option, but I think I might grab another top if I can. Because the only thing, too, is we're going Friday night. We're going out for tiki drinks with the League of Decency. If you guys, if you guys remember from the um, Classy Chicks live streams, um, Emily is the League of Decency. So we get to see her. So very exciting. Um, so, again, I just kind of layer everything in my suitcase. Um, like I said, I don't even know if that's going to end up being the actual suitcase. I'm trying to fit things in there. So that's Friday. So Saturday is Disneyland. And it is Disney bounding. Why do I keep doing this? I don't know. To fill up the frame, maybe. Because <laughs> I'm excited. All right. So. What? Oh, <laughs> that's funny. That is funny. Um, I am Disney bounding as Sabine Wren from Star Wars. And I hand painted the skirt with her starboard symbol on it. Um, I'm not entirely happy with the paint job, but I think for now it's going to be what it is. And why that is, I will explain a little later. So again, holding things up. Five years. What? Did we, did we start talking? If I heard you miserably on hip. Oh, oh, because your caftan gives you butterfly wings. <laughs> exactly. Butterfly wings. I hope we talk Doctor Who, because I will be very upset at myself if I did not hear you and did not talk about Doctor Who with you. So with that one, I got a brand spanking new top to go with that one. I haven't even taken the tags off yet. I probably should try it on to see if it fits. So I'm hard to hope. They do some of my favorite tops. I can't remember the name of this one though. I don't remember, but it's so stinking cute. Came to YouTube to look up something for work. Now I'm here watching your wonderful hair. <laughs> um, so yeah, I'm really excited. I think this top is gonna be super cute with it. Um, it's got the little bow there, off the shoulder detail. Fun, fun, fun. And then, to go with that, I made, da, 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 you guys helped me, I made these little ears. These are based on her uh, Mandalorian helmet. Didn't turn out as well as I wanted, but hey, that's okay. I got custom ears. So, I did film the tutorial on how I made these, um, which will be going up in a week or so. That is going to go in later because we don't want to get those crushed. So, as I do this as well, whew, I don't know why I can't breathe. Haha, <laughs> dancing flowers. It is like dancing flowers. Okay, so 
for the Friday outfit, the black bats. Yes! You're right. Corpse course. <laughs> You're right. You can't go to Disney without custom ears. So these were the these were the shoes. Thanks, Dark Rose. These are the shoes that I wanted to wear. They're the Jessica Simpson ballet flats because, interesting to know, not all of her ballet flats are leather. These are actually man-made. They're pleather. And I was super excited. But if vegan is something you need to worry about, not all of them are. But I wanted to wear these. But for Disney, no. But hi, Taz and Baby. Um, uh, so I'm going to bring my Bianca Lux because they are the most comfortable shoes I have ever worn in my entire life. I am addicted to them so much so that I have two colorways. So I'm going to be taking both these pair of shoes. So I'm just going to set them on the blow so I don't forget them. The other thing that I want to do as well is start thinking about the jewelries, which I didn't really think about you guys. My life has been so busy. So I don't know what I'm going to do for earrings and that kind of stuff. I thought about mouse ears, but not actual Mandalorian Star Wars items to wear on my body. So, um, I don't know. I don't know what I'm going to do. We're going shopping, so I might find something when we're shopping. So for right now, I'm not going to do much with that. But what I am going to do is I'm going to walk off the screen because that's great YouTube, right? To just not even be in the video. This is my little box of uh, all my goodies, my Splendette, my Lux Light. Love your channel. Greetings from Pennsylvania. Hey, well, thank you, Taz and Baby. Um, what I am going to bring to go with the bat skirt, treasures is. Oh no! Oh no! So. Um, does anybody know the reference for that? Treasure is my little, <clears throat> the um, Micheline Pitt, little devil, because we are going to go to the Vixen store, so I want to wear that. What else do I want to wear? I don't know right now. But do do do. I have no idea. I am so accessories blocked right now. It's not even funny, but I have clothes on. That's the important part. All right, so next up is going to be Saturday, Sunday, Sunday, which is Dapper Day. Um, I am going to, oh, I don't know why I said it that way. I'm gonna be wearing uh, this skirt. Um, I did make this one. It actually used to be a dress that I made <laughs> no, <laughs> they wouldn't. I don't think they let me in naked though, would they? Um, this used to be a dress. Um, clothes are good. Hey, Liz, clothes are always good. They are, aren't they? So, yep, I made my dress into a skirt. The reason why I did that is because the top that I made, uh, didn't like it, didn't like the way it fit, wasn't comfortable. Thank you. Um, but I love it so much. I do want to revisit making this back into a dress. But I was like, I really want to wear this for Dapper Day. I wanted to wear something that I made. Um, so, yeah. So, it's got like this little petal. So, that is what I'm wearing. It's very Cinderella-like. So, that's going in. Now, um, here's the thing, you guys nine o'clock at night bringing along a sweater because it's pretty cold for us Californians I will do that although it is snowing here right now which I am not very excited about um so I bought this top from the oblong box shop and the reason why I really liked it I don't know if you guys can see that it's got like the um the striations in there like a faux linen which kind of resembles the material on the dress and it's white with little silver going through it. Ew, snow. Ew. Uh, we're supposed to get like four inches tomorrow, Liz. Um, so, yeah. 
This is the top. Here's the problem. It was on clearance. The only size I had was size too big for me. So I still have to go downstairs and like, because the biggest problem is the cups on it were too big. So I have to stitch them down. So I still have to do that. So that's not going in yet. But um, what is going in with that, I think I am going to wear, let me know. These are my options because I definitely want to wear a hat. Well, I guess I really, well, scratch that. I guess I have one option because all my other hats are too dark blue. Ew. So I have this little blue hat. Oop, that's the wrong way. How embarrassing. So we'll be wearing this. Florida, it's nice. Oh, Sarah. Oh, Sarah. I wish I was with you right now. So we'll be wearing this in some way, shape, or form. It's going to ruin your Halloween plans. It is going to ruin Halloween plans. So this will be on my head in some way, shape, or form. Probably. Most likely. I swear, I'm missing hats, you guys. But it goes along very nicely with the skirt. So I'm really excited about that. I just hope we have snow. This here, this year, climate change has been messing it up in the Netherlands. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that climate change. I tell ya. I tell ya. We skipped spring. Some are already locked and loaded. <laughs> oh, the southern hemisphere. Um, these are my other Bianca Lux. Oh my god, your hats are amazing. Thank you. Um, they are silver. I'm going to be wearing these. Um, I'm going to hide the fact that the, the bottom, I wear, I wear them a lot. So I have to glue those before I go. I also have to clean the house, do my bills, clean out the litter boxes, sew a top, and get up at 7.30 tomorrow morning. It's fine, you guys. <laughs> so, <laughs> well, hey, Sandra, how are you? Sandra's, I think Sandra's still down in Florida. Um, so excited going to Disney. All right. So the next thing I want to think about, you guys are already like, that suitcase is not working. Hello, Miss Margaret. Oh, Texas. Why didn't I think you were in Florida? I'll be awake at 3 a.m. It's a possibility. Is my belts. Uh, where do I get my belts? People ask me that a lot. And I will say... My shoes do need to be cobbled. Um, strangely, half the time I don't remember where I get them. Some I get, oh my God, my hair, I'm just falling apart. Um, some of them I get at Kohl's, believe it or not. Yes, I like Kohl's. Um, your hell bunny skirt, yay. Um, I get them, some I have gotten at the Oblong box shop. Um, this is the problem that I have with a lot of them. Here, let me show you. Let me show you. There are a couple different types that you can get. Um, these are the ones that I get at Kohl's. Um, it says man-made materials on it, so that's good. What I like about these is there is actual metal in them, so they tend not to warp at all. So uh, these are my favorite belts. The only downside to that is they don't carry them in a lot of colors. These are the only two colors I have ever seen at Kohl's. Um, am I bringing the red one? No, but I'm gonna bring the black one. The other options, excuse me, is, oh, there's a, there's a third option. <laughs> God, I'm so weird. This is the third option. These you can find at Melco Modes a lot. They clip in. And they look like this. These are great because you can wash them, which is really, really nice. But um, sometimes I just don't like the look of this at the waistline. Um, so that's just a preference. But in, um, I think it's nice for like sportier looks. We're here because you love my weirdness. Excellent. Excellent. Um, this is what I was thinking. I was like, you know, there is no like perfection here. I know there's a lot of YouTubers who won't even go on YouTube without like everything done up, but 
that I may um I haven't seen about like that in years I didn't know they still sell them they do and then these are the honestly I don't remember where this one came from that's how long I've had it this one came from the oblong box shop some sort of doodad to cover the fastener you don't want you're right Miss Margaret it just needs a doodad sorry now my brain's thinking um this is what I don't like about this watch this one's a little bit better because it's a little bit more sturdy. Skim. Autumn stayed winter for five minutes and now we're in spring. Oh, oh, Melbourne. You're getting the exact thing we're getting here. Um, this one's even worse. There are some that are so flimsy, like this will actually slip through it. So, yeah, it's a little. Oh, thank you. I uh, did not have time to get them redone before I'm going, so creepy Halloween nails it is. Four seasons and one day in Melbourne. Sounds like Chicago. I get that a lot as well. All right, so I'm bringing the white, white, white belt. Snazzy nails. Thank you, girl. So that is that. Because this, this one will go with my star wars this will go with the black skirt this will go with my princess skirt why do i wear belts so much because i need waist definition there's because of my love of french fries mm -hmm. oh this is the other thing i bought specifically for this um i'm going to i'll eventually put a link but i got this from a jolly holiday on Etsy. You can always use a brooch to cover the doodad belt closer. You're right. Um, this is for Etsy. They are the best accessory. And look at this. Look at that. How cute is that? And it goes perfectly. And I like it that it's like a thicker brooch as well. It's just cute. I think it's resin. Perhaps, perhaps. <laughs> Literally, my dinner was french fries from Five Guys. But they have the best fries in town. So that's going to go over there. I still don't know what I'm going to do. I think if we're wearing bats, though, will you be vlogging or at least... Oh, no. It went away. Love those french fries. I think you were asking me if I was going to be vlogging or doing something. Um, I have a hard time dressing vintage retro. Oh, no, girl, no. You're, no, 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 no. Don't let your brain do that to you. You're fabulous. Whether you've gained weight or not gained weight. So you dress the way you want to dress. It's going to make you feel good. You do it. You do it. And then I want photographic proof. Girl, you know me. I would actually, <laughs> Liz knows I eat potato skins at our game night every week. Um, I would actually take five guys fries over potato skins any day. I know. Bennigan's needs to step up their game. Um, if I'm doing bats, no girl. That's right, Cassie. They are checking you out. Yes. Yes, Sandra. It just means she has style. She's awesome. A hot topic. Oh, so cute. Photographic proof, girl. You tag me on the on the gram. So if we're batting, we're doing the I think this is from Deer Arrow. I think. If it's not, she still has amazing stuff. So I think this is gonna go. Is that Miss Fortune costume? This is that what I just saw. I am, I think I might bring my vlogging camera. I don't know if I'm vlogging. Be, just because, um, oh, you got one Halloween themed. Awesome. Yes, Wendy. Girl, I, vintage, I think, flatters everybody. All depends on, yeah, just no. Mm, mm, mm. I love it. 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 Obviously. But, um, this has just evolved into, I don't know what you guys. Uh, big. I really wish I could see it. I would love to see a vlog. 
I know it's hard. I know, Ronkasa. I never can say your name right. You know that. <laughs> I love you, though. Um, yes. You have fun. You be you. Um, I'm going to bring it. I don't know, because I feel like a lot of times, like, I'm just so vloggy when, when I'm there. And, um, things have not, um, <laughs> cha, it goes cha, I'm on cha, um, yeah, it's been a bit of a rough year, um, be a flamingo and a flock of penguins, you're right, Trina, um, it's been a rough year, um, mentally, so your boobs are large and in charge, <laughs> Oh, Horror Beauty FX made it. Yay. Yes. I love this group of people. Love it. Um, yeah, so I think I might just kind of be there, but I'm definitely going to be doing stuff for the gram. How much do I hate myself right now for continuously calling Instagram the gram? I kind of do. But, any hoodle, I will be doing stuff. So, <laughs> Um, there will be stuff going up on my social media, so there's that. All right. Here's the thing. This is what I do. I'm going to go off screen again because over here you see that you don't see. I have these little boxes. Um, I got them with, there's stuff in it right now, but we're going to take that stuff out. But I got these little boxes, um, actually in a subscription box. It was the box of happiness that my friend got me. And I use this to actually house my jewelry. And because it is plastic, it's not going to get squished. So this is actually perfect for hair flowers. So, you guys ready to see some uh, Hi, friend! Here, I'm going to move you over here so you can actually see some stuff that I'm over here looking at. I'm like, how messy is it? <laughs> Real life? No. Um, because I can't, my drawer here, it's just so stuffed full. Do you guys remember when I did the Amazon video? These flowers, vintage hats for traveling in a suitcase. That is a great question, and I'll get to it in just a minute. Um, these Amazon flowers that I got, I got like a bag of them. Oh my god, I wear them constantly. It's ridiculous. So basically, I will just shove a bunch of my flowers in here, and I'll be bringing this, which is um, from Nococo Creations. It was a custom one. Um, it is an option to go with my hat if I don't end up wearing my hat with the blue dress. So I just want that as an option or I actually might add it to the hat and make it extra fabulous. I don't know. You never know what's going to happen. Um, so I'll just throw my little flowers in there with some of my jewelries and that's all good to go. Oh. Um, just, I feel a bit, uh, I feel a bit soft, guys. Oh. Okay. Okay, guys. We're going to, we're going to have a little talk. No, you're right. Nobody is normal. Okay. Here's the thing. Um, sometimes I, even after all this time, I can feel like, am I ridiculous, right? How does a packing video turn into this? I don't know. That's what happens, right? Okay. So even me, sometimes I can be like, am I too over the top? Am I too loud? Am I too much, right? Um, am I a ridiculous spectacle? It happens, right? Um, and then something really surprising happened. When I was doing the... Um, <laughs> I love that you're not normal. None of us are. None of us are. And as soon as we embrace all of that, then we are our true selves. But um, I was doing the recreating the horror movies. I don't know if you guys have seen them on the gram or not. Um, <laughs> Normal is only setting on a dryer. Oh my God, that's hilarious. 
and a sea of black dots. Shiny gold diamonds. So, um, yes, because the world is, would just be better if everything was filled with glittery colors. But when I was doing the photograph of recreating the um, Mia Farrow um, See No Evil, um, I had to do it in a normal colored wig. Um, <laughs> and you were fabulous, Button. I had to do it in a normal colored wig, which was very, very close to my natural color. I had to do it without my glasses. I had to do it in a pair of like leggings and really long sweater, which ended up being too long for the recreation, but my other options weren't great. And my friend was taking the pictures and she did a great job. And the day of the shoot, it was horrible. It was horrible. I'm like, I can't even look at myself. I can't post these. These are terrible. Because I just had all these flashbacks of me trying to wear clothes that were hip and that other people were wearing, trying to be like other people and trying to fit in and feeling miserable and feeling like I looked miserable because I was trying to fit myself into a box that wasn't me. And it was only becoming who I really want to be and embracing my differences that um, I have felt happier. I've just been happier. And um, the fact that I was starting to get into that cycle where, no, it's still live, girl. Katie, you still here. Yes. Yay. Come see me. Um, but just, I know I said it was going to end at 930. I was wrong because <laughs> I talk too much. Um, and it's just one of those things. So don't ever feel like you're a spectacle because you're not. When you start trying to be what you think other people expect you to be is when you start becoming unhappy. And if your happiness makes people think you're a spectacle, we only have one life to live. And life is hard sometimes. And if we can find, yes, be authentic. Um, so don't, 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 don't. Photographic proof, Miss Margaret. Um, Katie, I don't know. I'm not doing a meetup or anything. Um, but I will be there with purple hair. And we shall be around. Disneyland isn't really that big of a place, right? All right, so let's talk about packing hats really fast. Um, this is what I do. Um, I will usually take stuff... Um, Normally, like, uh, now I need to iron my skirts. <laughs> you do, girl. All right. I'm going to get out my knickers drawer. Not that many knickers in there. <laughs> They're all in the wash. All right. So what I do is I take things like my bra and I shove them in there. <laughs> you will find me. Um, I take things like. I don't know, like my little shorts that I wear under my skirts. Uh, I wear Victorian closings when I get the chance. I stick out like a sore thumb, but I don't really care. I really feel great. Yes! Oh my God, I would love to see that. Oh! I just think there's a lot of people out there when they get the nerve, like they'll come up and tell you how awesome you look. Pity those that judge you on your looks. They're stuck in a box and can only think of those. Yes, 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 yes. And I roll them up. And I stick these into the hat as well. So basically, I just keep sticking things in there until it is the shape of the hat. So that when I put it... You have to be you, Button. You have to be you. You have to be a woman of undeterminate age wearing cat ears and being gone to the day you die. Um, and then... I tend to leave also. <laughs> Thanks. Yes, and Liz, you look very good in your patchwork coat and your ruffles. They envy your sense of fun button. They do. So, um, yeah, so everything's in there so it holds the shape of the hat. <laughs> and I tend to put, my hats tend to be the last thing I put in there. And I put it on top. Um, so 
if you have something that is more of like a brimmed hat like this again shove everything that you can inside of it then something like this you want to be kind of not on the bottom because you don't want a lot on top of this but you want it in the suitcase so that you can take things and place it around it so that it kind of protects the top of it does that make sense I thought I would be able to do more like showing things, but it's hard because I have to do this on my phone, my iPhone. I can't even do it on the computer. Um, the other thing that I like to do before I go is I like to stop at Ulta for just one or two things. <laughs> Several steamer trunks and hat boxes. Oh my God, I love it. Um, I can tell you right now though, this is probably going to not be the suitcase that goes see here's my problem though the other suitcase is so insanely large that i don't know what to do so um i do have some viva packing tips as well which when this video goes up i will put in the description um because that one as well has some good tips about like hair supplies and stuff because here's the thing i don't pack my hair stuff and my makeup until the morning hi frank um because i will use them and i pack them as i use them stuff gets crushed if the clothes is packed too loose that is true um but oh god remember thumbs up the video love oh thanks friday yeah, YouTube hasn't liked me lately. My videos aren't doing so hot. Um, I will get travel sizes of a lot of my face cleaning, cleaners, cleaning, cleaners stuff so that it takes up less room. And this is the other thing that I wanted to show you guys. I set it aside. It's this thing. I got it from Eagle Creek. The reason why I love it, it's got a hook on it and it is like a toilet jar not like a toiletries bag it is a toiletries bag so um skincare yes skincare that's it um and i will place the things in here because you can just hang it you don't because usually sink space especially if you're jl and i um gets really crowded with curlers and makeup and everything else and if you can have some stuff like hanging off the towel rack or the door it saves uh space on the sink and everything is all packed into one location eh? all right what other questions do you guys have i feel like i feel like this was supposed to be like i was like i got a plan i'm gonna do this this is my plan and it didn't go according to plan but it was fun so that's all that matters, right? All right. So um, if you have any last minute questions, go ahead. What is your showstopper outfit for the trip? <laughs> you threw me off my plan, Wendy. I like it though. This, it is the... Um, this skirt. I don't know if I'd say showstopper. Um... Life is what happens when you're busy making other plans. You are correct, Cassie. Um, trying to think. Thank you. So yeah, for the most part, oh no, you know what I just noticed? My Martian ears came off my headband. How do you plan a wardrobe out, of, out for an event? Oh, so many options, love the skirt. Um, too old to trick or treat. He hides candy around the house. Oh my God. You're the best husband ever. Oh, oh no. What did I just do? Oh, okay. What are you wearing on Sunday? With my hat. Um... So apparently I'm going to have to put my Martian ears back on. That is okay. But 
I still have to pick out my jewelry. I don't know. I don't know. What goes with the skirt, Debbie? Well, it is a top that I have not finished fixing. This one. <laughs> uh, mm, Katie. Well, I will say this. Technically, I'm not supposed to Disney bound on Sunday. Um, no. Oh, I'm sorry. That is... No, I think you're right. That is sat that is Sunday. What is Saturday? What is Saturday? Saturday is this one. It's my Sabine Ren skirt. Very excited. Do you like how I packed and then completely unpack it? Oh Meg, you're so right. I'm gonna get my jewelry at the expo. Brilliant woman. And then I am going to be bringing these glasses for Sunday, which I'm totally Disney bounding as Cinderella. But don't tell anybody because it's Dapper Day and you're not supposed to Disney bound. Um, and then I will probably, I think, I don't know. What do you guys think? Hold on. We're going to bring you over here. So if we're doing, you can stare at my wall for a second. Oh, thanks, corpse, course. So hard to say. So many people bound for. <laughs> oh, thanks, Meg. Um, Debbie, this is Arctic Fox. I used a mix of a couple of their colors. Um. Ooh, Leah, and a Star Wars poodle skirt. That's so cute. So cute. Jail's um doing uh Princess Leia on uh. Saturday. I'm getting my days confused. Okay. So for that outfit with the skirt, the tan skirt that I just showed you, this is the top. I don't know what glasses to wear. What the heck? You can. <laughs> okay. I'm going to be like anybody, if anybody will actually listen to me about it, I will be like, well, Megan Katie said, bound, but make it dapper. I did. Yes, 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 yes. Okay. So this is my option. Okay. I can't, I know. It would make sense to wear these, but here's the thing. These are my old prescription. So, unless I wanna be blind half the day. So, these are broke right now, so I can't wear those. I'm guessing you had to bleach all the hair. I did have to bleach, yeah. So, here are my options. Let me know what you think. Because I, I don't wanna wear any of the little glasses, because. My eyes are getting bad. So we have these. Option one, which I know a lot of people don't like these because these are my cosplay glasses. So you don't see them very much. So that's option one. Option two, Moana and Hey Hey. <laughs> that's awesome. And then option three, Oh, these are so dirty. Um, they, uh, none of them are vintage because I have a really big head. Um, <laughs> I, I got, get them. Oh, that would be cool. And then this is option three. So far we got an option two. Um, I get them from, ooh, two, 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 one or two, two, two. Oh, well, I guess we know what glasses I'm wearing with this one. Okay, cool. Um, so I get them from Zenny. I get them from Zilu. Uh, ooh, Meg threw in a three. Meg's like, I don't care. I will stand alone on three. Um, two, then one, then three. Okay, I think it's two then. All right, so I'm very excited about that. I have to wear black shoes with that because I, <laughs> all my tan shoes hurt my feet. And nobody is going to Dapper Day and having aching feet all day. So, apparently, if you guys want to know how to pack for Dapper Day. <laughs> Ta-da! <laughs> oh, glasses USA. Ooh, nice. So, yeah. So, that's it. It is, um, oh, wow. 
I am way over the time that I said it was going to be. So I am going to skedaddle, vamoose, all that kind of good stuff. Thank you guys so much for coming out and hanging out with me for this. Uh, you made this so much better, figuring out everything. <laughs> Thanks, Wendy. Ta -ta. Um, you made everything so, so much better. Love it. Um, and I... Yay, Meg! Yay! Um... I'm going to be putting up lots of outfit pictures. Um, oh, hey, Amy, you're going to keep me talking for another hour. Um, I will see you on Sunday. Ah, yes, Miss Margaret, love you. Photographic proof. Um, how's the living room makeover going? <laughs> it's not at all. I am going to be ordering my wallpaper soon, though. Um, and my, what do you call it? Couch. Yeah, by the end of the year. So I'm very excited about that. So, um, yeah, I'm very excited. Um, stay tuned to my social media and all that kind of good stuff. I will be posting pictures of the outfits and all that good stuff and all our fun. And thank you guys. Oh, I try. Some days I'm not, honestly. Some days I'm the saddest sack in the universe. But um, I try because, again, life is life. And we got to take the good, take the bad, take them both. And there you have effects of life. Um, all right, Amy, we will feel your spirit. Maybe somewhere around the haunted mansion. <laughs> Yay, Wendy. It's almost four o'clock. You need to go to bed. <laughs> Expo shopping for jewelry. Perfect. Bye, Frosting. Bye, Miss Margaret. Bye. Thank you guys so much. If you like this video, go ahead and click on the thumbs up. If you're new to this channel, make sure that you subscribe to this channel so you don't miss out new videos. And I hope you guys have a great night. Thank you. Love your faces. And I will see you. Oh, hi, Justy. I will see you guys all later. And you know what? Here's the thing. I don't even know how to. I think I just hit the little X in the corner. What's this button do? Click. <laughs> Doesn't hang up. Oh, Trina, you are glitter in my world. I love you guys. Good night.